digging and digging. So uh, I'm going to send out a short video today. So anyone with experience can tell me. So this is like a big concrete platform. All right. It goes to about just a little bit out further. All right. Um, with no hole in it. Here I am where the owner's son told me the outhouse was, okay? No rock lining. I don't see any rock lining anywhere around this thing. At first I said I did because I saw some rocks and assumed they would continue. But it's just one, two rock, one rock here, one rock here. So I'm gonna dig a little more and then I'm just gonna go to detect mode and um, detect around the property a little bit and post this video tonight on my buddy uh, Badger's page and uh, let him tell me what he thinks. And Carrie, let Carrie see it too. Um, I've never done a privy before. So before I dig the Timbuktu, um, I wanna make sure that this is plausible, that you don't have to have all that around it, but I don't believe it to be so. I actually believe I might be in the wrong location and maybe they put this over the privy hole instead. So let me know what you guys uh, think when, I, when you see this. Seriously, I need some comments because I don't want to dig forever. Get back to you. So I decided to detect the hole, right? And no signals, I mean, devoid of even iron. And then on my knocks, I have something dinging between 15 and 17 in here. Uh, and it shows it's about pretty much a foot down. And uh, so I'm just gonna dig down to that. And depending on what it is, that could be it for today for just digging this out. I'll just fill the dirt back in and um, get with the owner and talk to him one more time about it. it. It's the owner doesn't really remember, it's his son who does. So it's tough trying to get someone to you know, go back that far in time. And then when the landscape has changed so much, um, but the nice thing is, is I dug out uh, a couple weeks ago around that tree. And so next year, they'll be able to put a garden there. And there was a garden there at one point. So um, I think that's pretty cool in itself. So let's see what I find. If I find anything, I'll let you know. Let you know either way, because that, that'll be a wrap for this part of it. Uh, we're not, we're done. But what I did, after burying up my hole, that I just fell in, is uh, here is that big... It's not as big as I thought it was. It's concrete. That's the outline of it. And there was a broken piece here I wedged up and started digging down into it. And it's really good soil. And there's a lot of little rocks in it. So I'm really gonna need you guys to help me. Like do, I always thought the well or whatever it was, not the well, but the privy itself went all the way up to the top. So I don't know if that's the deal or if they could have buried it and it could be sitting down lower and that's why the big depression or if they capped it with this. And if so, once again, where would the stone lining be for that? So whew, now I'm done. I'm going to put this back and then, uh, and of course, I'm going to hit a couple more swipes and I'm going to put it back and I'm going to detect for a little bit. Get back to you. Hey guys, just found this little ditty. Guess what it is? It's a knife. It's old, man. Oh, look at that. There we go. There we go. Very old knife. Here's the other side of it. Coolness. Knife in the pocket. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. And you know me, guys. I'll clean it up. I'll make it look real good. All right. There's a relic. I'll get back to you. All right, guys. Persistence pays off. Got me a coin. Probably a weedy. Could be a mountain even. I don't know. It wasn't that deep. So we'll see together. It looks like a sweetie. 1909 VDSB. 42. Good year. Good year. Started kicking ass in World War II. 
pretty deep down there. Look at that hole, guys. Hold on. But, uh, you know, hey, we've hit this area, but it's so big. And there was so much traffic in different time periods that, I don't know. You're always going to find, uh, we always find stuff. So, I'm pretty happy. All right. Onward and upward. Probably only have about another hour or two of daylight. So, I better get cooking. I think I got me a silver dime. I don't know what kind of yet. But, it is really jumpy really like high 20s low 30s but, but solid and you can see it was under this here's the deal with the knocks um there was a, a nail right on top but i knew that wasn't it because it was too solid and it was underneath that root so that's pretty cool man all right it's a merc i think what we got what we got a mercury and it's funny, the sun said, oh, you guys should find a lot of mercury dimes. We play with them all the time. I think I found one before. Here. Nice. That's beautiful. Look at that. That's been it. And that's a 41. The, the penny I found just a few feet behind me, that was a 42. So, I am tickle paint. Tickle pink, guys. Tickle pink. Get back to you. Two more steps, and I got another weedy signal. Shovel's still in. I went to pop it, and I didn't turn it in time to cut the root. And I went like that, and the penny just popped out. I'm assuming it's a weedy because of the... Let's see... Nineteen forty something, right? Okay. Rub it up. Rub it up. So obviously I'm I am uh in an area that was traveled. I could tell you by the years on here, forty five, that it has absolutely nothing to do with the canal. It's just because there's houses here, you know, home sites here along the canal. Because uh, the canal was long gone by then. All right, get back to you. Onward and upward. What a beautiful day. Turning out to be a good day. Every day is a good day when you can come out and do this. Right, guys? Man. All right, I'll get back to you. Clump fell over it. But, uh... Wow, what a day. <laughs> Let me show you. Now, you can see right behind, right? Another Merc. Beautiful. And that is a 43. Nice, <laughs> look at that. Wow. You, you know, guys, I'm wondering if when the son was talking to us he got because the son's got to be in his 60s you know the, the boy to the property owner the boy <laughs> but the way he described it he told us to go to the left of where i am and that's where you know in the earlier part of this video you'll see um the the outhouse but he told me yeah yeah when you go over there you should find lots of Mercury's. So, you know, I'm a little bit further from where it was, but I'm, now I'm starting to find them. So, I wonder if he got confused. I mean, it's quite plausible. But hey, I'm not going, I'm not going to be upset, right, guys? Forty-three. Let me get that. So I can send a picture to Frank. He's at work. Make him weep. See, I'd send something to JR, but then he'd just end up showing me like a gold coin or a half dollar he dug. Sweet. All right. I'll take a picture of it. Get back to you. Hey, you too, birdie.
guys, I think, let's see, it's probably another weedy because it, and I say that because they keep coming up, you know, under the same signal, jumpy and, yep, Uno scent. Rub dub, rub dub, don't do no fancy stuff, just a rub a dub. Ooh, this looks old. That's so old, I'm gonna have to clean it up at home. All right, get back to ya. Well, it's a weedy, you guys can. Oop, now you can't see. <laughs> and I'll check the hole to, uh, yeah, you can see the, the scent, the boom. All right, I'll check the hole pretty deep. Pretty deep, about six, seven inches. Get back to ya. Having fun. What a beautiful, beautiful sight, right, guys? This is my office. Loving it. Gotta go home soon. Getting hungry. Ah, oh, we're not. We're. I just found this, and oh man. It's a lock with the key still in it. Who knows what's on it? Wow. Look at that. Can you? <laughs> uh, that's a first for me. Now, I found a couple of these little ones in the entire, you know, um, complete and whole. I never found one with the key in it i don't think that's a play with it here thing so <laughs> wow i love it you guys even hear me get excited about the silver right but i find a stupid little lock with a uh, a key in it and i'm like ah that's cool though that is way cool <laughs> all right onward and upward say thank you for uh watching if you watch the whole way through thank you so much please subscribe and like and uh, i hope you enjoyed it. it turned out to be a really really nice day i uh, went up we'll get back to you god bless every one of you do the right thing all that spiel just be happy